Hi guys, how are you all doing? You're back with me Daza and today for lunch we are having some Bun Limited Spicy Mexican Hot Dogs. Um, we're not having four, right? Because four would just be sheer piggery. We're not having four. We're going to go for two. Um, it says in the back, hot dogs. It's your dog, your way, store whole back. Now, I thought you could cook them multiple ways. I thought you could put it in a fry, not a frying pan, in a, a pot and do it in the hob. Uh, but apparently you can only make them. So, make rave 600 watts. You want to put your four hot dogs in that on a plate for two minutes. Now, I've only put two in. I've left two at the side. So, these are two that I made a wee bit earlier on. New Buchanan style, Art Attack for his 90 kids. Here's two I made earlier. There we are. Two hot doggies, right? They do look quite spicy to look at. They smell like they've got something to them. I picked these bad boys up in Morrison's. Now, I went and got them on Asda, on the online shop. I had to go and click and collect it. That's fine. So, if you do an online shop, it tells you before you actually get your shopping what they've substituted and what they've got for you recently. So, these were substituted, but we were actually in Morrison's over the road. And said to the missus, oh, the fuck, not give me my hot dogs. That's one I wanted to try. All right. Walked by the shelf, Morrison's. There they are. Fantastic. In the, in the basket, and that was it. So these are two of these uh, Bun Limited uh, spicy Mexican hot dogs. And if within the whole rush, another day we were out and about, right? I had to get my shop between two and three from Asda. We were in Morrison's until uh, we were actually at like five minutes late, and I was saying, I'm not going to get my shopping. She went, calm down, you'll get your shopping. I was having a hair of canary. She's like, listen, don't get your knickers in a twist. Just calm down. They're not going to not give you your shopping. And she was right. So, went and got these. But in the whole melee, uh, in the confusion and the hustle and bustle, I forgot to pick up hot dog rolls. I fear not. Because Aldi have come to our assistance. Now, I know it's not a hot dog roll. It's what in the name of Christ was that? Um, it's not a hot dog roll, it's a thin, but it's not a Warburton's thin, it's an Aldi thin. So what we're going to do, we're going to do a wee kind of bit of like a DIY. We're going to take two bits, chuck them, get a hot dog, snap it in half. Right, put it in there. They're a bit oily. They glisten, glisten of my thumb. Right, snap the other one in half as well. And whack it on the roll. Now what I do with everything, even scrambled egg, barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce is the bollocks. You can never go wrong with barbecue sauce. A wee bit of that on the... And I'll show you my creation. Hope it doesn't slide off before we put it. Barbecue sauce on hard dogs. So there we go. So these are meant to be spicy Mexican hot dogs. So let's give them a wee go. Now before I click into this, bite into this bad boy, um, what is it I do? Now I've got another thing I do, right? I can't remember who told me to do this years ago, someone told me to do this years and years ago. You know you get the Chicago Town pizzas, the deep, the like microwave pizzas, two for, and two in a packet, right? You get two of them, you blast them in the microwave, cook them through, right? Then you get a two bits of bread, put one of the pizzas in a bit of bread, and you've got a pizza sandwich. It is the bollocks. If you haven't tried it, you need to try it. Uh, I might even do a video on it, I might even just, just to show you how it's done and how you can appreciate it, right? So there we are. It's two, uh, well, that's two spicy hot dogs from uh, Morrison's, actually, so here we go. Um, no spice. No spice whatsoever. No kick. You can taste like it's meant to be spicy, but there is no spice. There's a few herbs in there. In fact, I read this packet earlier on, right? 84% of that hot dog is pork. And you've got salt, herbs, spices, uh, acidity regulator, fuck me, all that kind of stuff, beef collagen. So it's not 100% pork, which is well, all right, but it's, it's got herb extracts in that, it's spices extracts, so it's not actually that spicy, guys. Uh, I can handle this, eat. there's nothing, there's nothing, no, no spice, there's the taste of spice, if you know what I mean, the herbs, you can taste all the herbs and the spices and that, but there is no spice, so I think they've sold us that one, look, four spicy Mexican hot dogs, normally Mexican food's quite hot and quite spicy, this isn't, don't get me wrong, it's a nice hot dog, mm. very nice, not too bad, Um. So, out of 10 for me, 
Then we get a seven, right? Average. If they were indeed even the smallest bit spicy, it would bump up. But it's selling on it, and it's telling you it's spicy, but it's not spicy. So, 7 out of 10. I would have them again. I would have them again, but I'd like to see them bring up a, a pack of hot dogs that were actually spicy. Because people are going to buy it, I think it's spicy when it's not. So, 7 out of 10. I would have it again. What do you guys think? And um, would you like to see the pizza video? If you'd like to see the, the, the pizza video with the sandwich, drop a comment below, say you want to see it. And if I get enough people want to see it, I'll do it. So guys, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of my lunch, my healthy lunch. Have a nice day, and cheerio.